And speaking of pets breaking out, but not the good kind, if you've ever found a stray pet, you know one of the first things to do is check to see if they have a microchip. It's a life-saving device that goes in the back that veterinarians or animal shelters can scan and read with a simple microchip scanner. But now some amazing Girl Scouts in town are making it even easier to reunite lost pets, and they definitely deserve a major shout out. If the scanner doesn't have any batteries, there's extra inside. Girl Scouts from Troop 1255 in Brentwood are working hard to make Nashville a better place. We all have pets of our own, and we always saw lost animal posters and stuff in our neighborhood, and it was really, really sad. And so we're like, we should do something about this. We should do, uh, uh, we should have a solution for this. And they did. The troop decided to research, purchase, coordinate, and install two microchip pet scanners as part of their sustainable community project. They named them Who's Paws, and they can be found at the Brentwood Library and Williamson County Animal Center. Over the years, we've sold many boxes of cookies, and so we used the funds from the cookies to sponsor this. This means if someone finds a lost pet, they can now head straight to the library and check for a microchip themselves, versus taking the pet to a veterinarian or animal shelter. Um, so I love animals. Our whole community here loves animals. We have beautiful walking trails around our library. People are always walking their dogs. So it's just, it's wonderful to know that our community loves this library so much that they chose us as a site to have this uh, microchip scanner. So how does it work? Don't worry, the girls have really thought of everything. So when you first get to our little kiosk, you have instructions on how to find the dog chip inside of there that way it's easy and quick and it shouldn't take you more than like five minutes and usually the chip is right in between the shoulder blades so you'll just hold it over until you hear a beep and then once you have the beep it will give you a code and you'll take a picture of that code and once you've taken a picture of that code you'll go back to the instructions and on there you'll find a list of vets offices you can call who will take the number and handle it from there and I'm happy to say, not surprisingly, the Girl Scouts from Troop 1255 earned their silver awards for these microchip machines. It's just really about helping the community and helping those people and, and reconnecting the animal, the animal, the pet, and the owner. Oh, well, so don't, cool. I know, such great, great girls. Don't forget to check out the two microchip kiosks if you ever need them. They're at the library in Brentwood and Williamson County Animal Care.